Get the tools you need to become a free and independent trainer with my Dumbbells of Dollars course at www.dumbbells2dollars.com. How are we doing everybody, Jonathan here, and in this video, in about mm, 10 minutes or less, I actually want to introduce you to my training staff, all right? So as this channel is transitioning into what it's like to be a gym owner, I think it would only be right for you to meet the people that help this gym go. Because as of, I don't know, about six months to a year ago, I have stopped training. I have taken myself off the training schedule so I can focus on the ownership aspect of running the gym. And these are the people that keep the gym running, keep the gym alive. I think it's gonna be very beneficial so you can see the different personalities that I work with, um, what I specifically look for. And I also want to know, this is your question of the day. You can only hire two of the trainers that you're gonna meet. Which two would you hire and why? Put that in the comment section below. But as always, if you find the information in this video helpful, make sure to click the like button. Um, if you have a question or comment, put it in the comment section below because you know engagement helps me, so make sure to do so. And yeah, I just wanna see uh, what you guys feel about the team as I will be incorporating them more into this channel because it's all a part of the gym ownership process. So, um, let's meet the first one now. Sir, yes, what is your name? My name is Jordy B. Jordy B, uh, are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? 20s. And how long have you been a trainer here? It's going on just about, it's been a little bit longer than a year. Okay, how did we meet? How did I find you? I actually applied on Indeed. Okay. And then you just shot me a text like, hey, come in and we'll chat. And then ever since then it's been a wrap. How long was the interview? Five minutes. Five minutes, five minutes. <laughs> um, any certifications? Um, certified, NASM certified, um, CPR in two different institutions, and I'm going for my nutritional course right now. Awesome. And what do you think is the greatest asset that you bring to this gym? What, which one of your many assets are you most proud of? My energy and my ability to read people. Let's I go. Know, I know when to give you that push and I know when to kind of take back a little bit and let you do your thing. Thank you, Jordy. Yes, and... Hey coach. Hey. What's your name? Jamie Dodds. Hey Jamie Dodds. So um, are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? Sadly in my 40s. Okay. And how did we meet? Uh, we met when I started BFF Bootcamp in Nutley in 2018. Okay. And how did you become a trainer? I became a trainer because I really enjoyed learning everything that I learned at BFF. And I started kind of moving on to... Um, you know, different movements and different exercises. And when you opened your own place here in Belleville, I reached out to see if you needed any help and here I am. Yeah. Do you remember how long our interview lasted? On the phone? I don't even remember. It was on the phone. I was at my mom's house, I remember. How long did it last? How long did the call um, last? I think we were on the phone for like 15 minutes, which is a really long time for you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's way long. Okay, um, so out of all of your great traits, all right, which one of your traits are you most proud of to bring to BFF Bootcamp? Um, I think I'm humble enough to know that I don't know everything. Um, and I love continuing to learn. And the trainers here keep me on my toes and keep me learning, as do you. I like it. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Soon. Hey, Coach. Hey. Uh, what's your name? Nicole Montague Scully. It's a long one. Okay, Nicole, are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? 40s. Okay, and how did we meet? We met how many years ago? I don't, um, I don't know, maybe like seven years ago uh -huh. at BFF boot camp in Nutley when you first started. And you were my client. I was your client. Yeah, and now yep. you're a trainer. I am. And do you remember how long our interview was? Um, no. I don't. <laughs> yeah, it's probably like less than five minutes. Okay, um, and so of your many wonderful traits, uh, which of them are you most proud of to bring to BFF Bootcamp as a trainer? I think um, my love for fitness. I really, really enjoy helping people. Um, I love watching people change and grow and achieve goals that they've been chasing, and that's why I'm here. Thank you. Good morning, coach. So, um, tell me your name. Got it, and are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? Okay, so why don't you tell your audience, um, how did we meet? Okay. 
Okay, and now you're a trainer. Okay, and um, do you know how long our, our interview lasted for you to become a trainer? Got it, got it. So, wait a minute, wait a minute. Are you hard of hearing? No. Oh, okay. So, why are you teaching, why are you talking to me in sign? I'm a sign language interpreter. Oh, that's your, uh, that's your main gig. That's my main gig. Okay, so I have one more question before I let you go. Out of all of your wonderful traits, which one of them are you most proud to bring to BFF Bootcamp? Got it. Pleasure to meet you, Steph. Hey, Coach. Hello. What is your name? Raina. Raina, are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? 30s. Okay, and Raina, how did we meet? Um, I came to a BFF class in the BFF Nutley location. Okay, and then you became a member? Yes. And how long were you a member before you became a coach? I would say like, a, it was about a year. Okay, and by chance, do you remember how long our professional interview took? Um, you were talking about getting a coach to the entire gym, and I said I wanted to do it, and you said no, <laughs> and because we were going about heads, and I said, just give me a tra chance, and then you said you were sorry that you felt that way because you love me. Yes, you're amazing. So, I mean, you weren't just like a boot camper. What's your, um, what's your athletic background? Um, I cheered and did crew in high school. I cheered in college, and then I have been doing fitness for the past, I don't know, 15 years. Great, great, great. Um, so, of all of your wonderful traits, which one are you the proudest to bring to BFF Bootcamp? Um, I'm very helpful and bubbly, and I bring a lot of positive energy. I also think you're the barbell queen. Like, you don't oh, let there. bad okay. form go by. Yeah. I thought you would say that, but if you're no. not going to say it, I'm going to let people know. Like, she's the worst one. Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you, Coach. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Hey there, Coach. Hello. What is your name? Alyssa Casolino. Alyssa, are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? 30s. Okay, and how did we meet? We met at boot camp in 2014. 2014, you were a client, right? I was. And now you're a trainer. I am. Is this the only place you've trained in your entire life? No, I have trained at the Max Challenge a couple different locations. Okay, and so now you're here. Mm -hmm. And so of all of your traits, mm -hmm. what trait are you most proud of to bring to the BFF bootcamp environment? Um, I like to see when people accomplish things that they thought they couldn't, whether that's a weight loss goal, whether that's doing 10 really good push-ups, or sticking to a nutrition plan. And they come and they tell us about it, and it makes me feel good. Great. Yeah. Great to meet you. Same to you. Bye. <laughs> What's up, Coach? What's up, Jonathan? All right, so what is your name? My name is Julio Ortiz. And Julio, are you in your 20s, 30s, or 40s? I'm in my 20s. All right, so Coach Julio, how did we meet? Well, I was driving down the road about uh, two years ago, fall of 21, and I was just curious, and I came in for some information. All right, so he took the aggressive approach and then came after me. So you're a personal trainer. Any certifications? Yes, I'm NASM certified, and I'm currently working on my CNC. Okay, so I have a question for you, Julio. You've been here for how long? How long have you been training here? Just about a year and a half. Just about a year and a half. So out of all of your traits... Um, what do you think is the best trait that you bring to BFF Bootcamp as a trainer? I'll say it's my passion for fitness and the love I have for being around a lot of people because I was always growing up around an athletic environment, sports, so being around a lot of people, working to better ourselves is always something that was part of my life and I love to be around that environment. I like it. Nice to meet you, Julio. All right, so you've met all of my trainers. I hope you enjoyed this video. I want to see, as I said before, if you could only hire two, which two trainers give you the best vibes? for whatever reason, if you can only hire two, which two would you hire? Um, as you can see, there was an obvious consistency amongst why they do this, um, and it's worked well for me. So I look forward to helping you to learn how to find talent, cultivate talent, keep talent, because you can't do it on your own, trust me. I work really hard, and <laughs> there was no way I was gonna be able to do this on my own, so we wanna learn how to do this correctly, all right? now. If you're in the beginning stages of this fitness journey, I definitely recommend that you go over to www.dumbbellsdollars.com and pick up the Dumbbells to Dollars course. That's essentially all of the foundational stuff that I needed to understand before I could take myself out of the gym and focus on the numbers, all right? I will soon be putting together 
a course just for gym owners. But for now, uh, if you want to get the basis of everything that's in my head and most of what's in my employees' heads, the Dumbbells to Dollars course is the best way to go. I'm gonna do my best to make videos twice a week, um, hopefully like Monday, Wednesday, or Monday, Thursday. But if you uh, give me ideas in the comment section on what you'd like to see, that'll give me more fuel for the fire. So that's about it. This video has been running long enough. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And as always, remember to eat healthy, hydrate, drive safe. Stress levels will get rest. Don't stop everybody. Love your clients. They love you back. I'll see y'all tomorrow or the next day, and you have a good one.